Hello, I am Dr. Sham K. Jaiswal. I am consultant neurophysician. I am working in the care hospital Panjara Hills and uh, I am working almost a decade in uh, this hospital this shoot, sir. Today I am going to talk about the COVID and, uh, and the problem with the brain, mainly the stroke. You know, because uh, since last uh, one and a half year, having affected by the COVID uh, all around world. And COVID is like that, it affects uh, not only the, only the lungs, it affects all, all the systems in the organs in the body. It affects the brain, it affects the heart, it affects the kidney, uh, it affects all the organs of the body. It, is, it doesn't spare any organ of the body. And the recent times we are seeing lots of patients coming with the neuro problems, neurology problems uh, due to COVID uh, infections. And one of the major we are seeing the brain stroke. This brain stroke uh, we see because of the COVID, this uh, the, co uh, the SARS-CoV virus, coronavirus, uh, it causes the increased blood clot formations in the body. And because of we see the increased blood clot in the brain, in the heart, in the kidney also. And usually it affects the major artery. The major artery means like the which goes from heart to the brain and affects and it causes the clot formation and causes the brain stroke. And after the brain stroke is usually uh, the COVID causes the major brain strokes. But uh, if we take care of these things timely, if we uh, address this issue of the stroke, where the, all the facilities, all the departments like multidisciplinary hospital, if it's there, uh, the patient can be managed very properly. So it is kind of teamwork. It just re not require the COVID team, critical care teams. Uh, it require the neurology teams and neurosurgery team also. We are seeing the many patients uh, uh, with the brain stroke. Uh, they coming and after that uh, they have the brain swelling in the brain because of the of the because of the clot. And some patient uh, we try to manage with the medicines and injections, but some patient require some surgery also right uh, we have to that's called a decompression surgery it's not a very major surgery not a minor surgery but it's a life-saving surgery and since last one and a half year we have done many of patients who come in with the covid and stroke and we try to manage them and many pay many patients life we have tried to save and some patient required the surgery also the second part uh, i wanted to address that some patients coming with the brain hemorrhage also because uh, I told you because coronavirus causes lots of clot formation in the body and because of that we have to give the preventive blood thinner medicines uh, in the, in the, to the patients and sometimes these blood thinner medicines can cause little bit reactions and cause the uh, brain hemorrhage also. But such kind of brain hemorrhage I seen not a very big brain hemorrhage, it is a small brain hemorrhage which can be managed uh, if we understand the problem very soon. Uh, I just want to uh, tell uh, my, all my friends and uh, all, the, all, the, all the citizens all around that we don't have to panic when the patients got the uh, COVID and don't have to worry if they got any kind of brain problems, uh, kind of brain stroke also or any, any problems are related to the corona. If we come to the proper uh, hospital where all the facilities are available, the patient's life can be saved and they can be cured also. So these are things other than the brain stroke, it can cause the nerve problem also. It affects the, the spinal cords um, and it affects some nerves also. But this all we have seen that this page, these are the not major uh, problem, neurology problem like the brain stroke and these patients have recovered very well uh, with the, some uh, kind of we see the complication also. But don't worry and uh, come to the proper hospitals where the, all the facilities are available and not, not to be panic and we can manage and we can save the lives and we can give the good life to the patients. Thank you very much. I just wanted to uh, tell about uh, a few words about uh, uh, this channel, uh, the doctor's advice channels, uh, which has been launched uh, since last one year. And it covers uh, both the Telugu states, uh, Andhra and Telangana, the based in Hyderabad, uh, Actually, this uh, channel uh, I find uh, is very, very informative and useful because uh, it just for the educations, the awareness and about the, uh, giving the good information to the general publics. And it's uh, uh, 
take care of all the doctors all the specialist doctors uh, neurology nephrology cardiology endocrinologist uh, liver specialist gastroenterologist uh, they take or uh, take care of all the all, all the doctors and they take their suggestions and opinions uh, for the patients educations about awareness about the health educations to all around us about the telco states so i'll definitely recommend your people regularly watch these channels where this all specialists speaking about uh, the different diseases and uh, educating the people about the awareness about the different diseases in the, in the in the all around the those cities for the common public so that their health and the life improves thank you very much we'll be covering uh, all topics which commonly affect patients on a day to day basis for more this type of doctor advices or opinion or any other things daichesi doctors advice channel like cheyandi comment cheyandi share cheyandi subscribe to this channel doctors advice 10 mandi ki upayogapade laga chudandi thank you so much